I still remember what happened two years ago, as if it was yesterday. I was having dinner with my family, when suddenly, fighting erupted. My family and I were forced to flee, and we became separated from each other along the way. I was lost and had nowhere to go, but finally, I reached a refugee camp. Two years had passed, and I still didn't know where my family was. It was my dad on the phone. My family missed me. They hadn't forgotten about me. They had found each other and reunited. At that moment, I knew where they were. But how would I travel to them? Soon, a stranger approached, asking me to trust him. He had his ways to get me to my parents. I was desperate and wanted to see my family as soon as possible. I later met an elderly woman who warned me not to trust this man. Her son had believed him and lost his life. Her son wished to reunite with his father, and the same stranger painted him a beautiful picture of a cheap journey to reach his father, only to discover the truth. The traffickers were cruel and treated them badly. They hit him again and again so he would pay them money, but he didn't have any. His father sent some, but for many, the money is never enough. She warned me like she had warned her son. She begged me not to trust the lies of traffickers and learn from the fate of our people who did. She told me that I am not alone. The UNHCR and its partners could help me reunite with my family. I went to the UNHCR the next day. There, I met Sarah who explained to me that although the process to reunite with family could be lengthy, it would be the safest way for reunification. She encouraged me not to lose hope and seek a quicker way by listening to smugglers and traffickers. This way was dangerous. Many months later, my application was approved, and I was on the plane to reunite with my family. Finally, the moment I have been waiting for, reuniting with my family. Family reunification is a right. Every country has their own eligibility criteria and process for family reunification. If you are separated from your family, Please check the government website where your family resides, the UNHCR webpage of the country where you reside, or approach UNHCR or a partner organization for more information. All services, including family reunification assistance, that UNHCR and partners provide are free of charge. If anyone requests money or any favor from you to obtain services, report it to any UNHCR staff where you are.